All right. Onward to find Tamara. We're going to a new town, too. It looks like it's a big walled-in area, so it's probably going to be a big city, I'm thinking. I guess we'll have to see. Sucks you so far away, but at least we'll unlock the fast travel there for quick, uh, quick access later. A lot of monsters in this area as I ride through. La 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 Right across the bridge, the Marauder's Bridge. Boom, 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 boom. Tell me to go this way, which is weird. Oh no, I see, because we're heading towards the waypoint. This isn't it, is it? This walled in area? Seems too close. That could be it, though. Yeah, look. I gotta go across this bridge. <laughs> Shut up. No, we're skipping the bridge. We're passing by this area, whatever it is. Come on, you stupid horse. We're almost there. I like how the waypoints just disappear for no fucking reason. Look, it's gone. Why is the waypoint missing? <laughs> fucking vanished. Look. The waypoint vanished, and I don't know how to get there. Look. I was supposed to take the bridge. The waypoint was fucking wrong. I knew it. Because I said, I, I said, I should take this bridge. No, the waypoint said go the other way. Ugh. They need to improve the fucking GPS stuff in this game. I mean, even though, you know, let's face it. We're being silly. No, that's not GPS. But still. Why the hell did the waypoints vanish when I was at the place I needed to go? Here it is. Ooh. I'll just go the other way. Yes. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Settled areas. The movement speed will be limited here. Halt. No passage. What? Case of the plague surface in the city or something. The plague? Uh, no. We're to not let folk in the city. It's an order, so I don't. Unless someone's got a pass. I bought a pass, remember? We bought it. This way, you mean? Let me look at that. Mm-hmm. Uh, missing a seal. The red one. Impossible. Department of Civil Defense forgot again. They're really off their heads these days. That happens. So be it. You may come through. Oh, he's actually letting us through. Huh. Come through. Hey, don't worry. All right, I get it. My movement speed's limited. You can get rid of that message now. Thank you. <laughs> All right, look at the size of this place. Huge, a huge town. And there's our waypoint. Good. <clears throat> Reminds me of Skyrim. Or I guess Oblivion. Oh look, a barber. Wait a minute. Can I get my hair cut? Oh shit. The Barber of Seville. Greetings, master. What can I do for you? Got a razor and shears? Good. Make me look decent. Ha. Huh. A shaved head and a ponytail. Long hair let down. 
Just a shave. Ah. Let's get a shave, too. There you go. Very nice. So long. Looking much younger. Wow, look at that. Looking way younger. <laughs> the game has turned into Grand Theft Auto. Where can I buy guns? Here's the bar, the uh, the inn or tavern. Your bread, your coin, all is shite. Mission board. Let's do it. Alright, got some new missions. Blacksmith over here. The truth is in the stars. When I look at the stars. Look at this guy. Greetings. My, my, a witcher. Something tells me I'll finally get something interesting to do. Sure doesn't look like you're short on work. So, this. The Redanian Army Order. But there's no pleasure in it. One after the other, same thing time and again. No finesse required. Looking to perfect your craft? Of course. Crafting's like plowing a maid. <laughs> Fall into a rut. Yes. Well, sure, you'll get the job done, but there'll be no hoops, no hollers, no standard ovation. So, got any special requests for me? Help me stay on form. Still talking about armor, aren't we? Aye. No, plowing a maid. Oh, that's fantastic. Let's see if we can craft anything that I want. No. Level 16. No, right now we're 11. Well, we're about to hit 11. That's what I have. Level 14. Oh, wow, level 14, I can use this. This is level 24. We got a while for that. That's shitty. Of course, level 27, we got that. We got a while for that. That's shitty. Assassin Gauntlets needs level 12. Darn, I'm close. I'm close to using the Assassin Gauntlets. They're really good. Tracker's Gauntlets is what I'm using. Level 27 for those trousers. So nothing there. Let's have him remove my gear. Remove my gear. Let's have him repair my gear. A few things for him to I could sell. Here we go. I'll sell this extra crossbow. These trophies I really don't need. Oh, I, I need need them later though. I don't know. Are right, you really the stupid dwarven axe? Shitty blunt axe. The pants. And this is a sword. Yeah. Wow. He's gonna be four sixteen for it, because I found a better sword. Cool, let's sell it. Boom, made a ton of money there. I don't think he has anything I want to buy. I don't see a saddlebag on him, now. We're going to keep my eye out for a new saddlebag that carries more. What's this? Amber Fragment. Nah. Okay. Good, that was good stuff. So long. Okay. Keep our open. Here's a merchant over here. Maybe this merchant has a better saddle bag. Let's look. So <laughs> the girl's right next what door too. <laughs> I've everything from apples to Taking a peek at my way. What can I do you for? Oh my if god. I it today, say the word, I'll have it tomorrow. What the fuck are you wearing? Are you from Star Wars or some shit? Let me see. Huh. <laughs> Anything good? It doesn't look like it. it looks like crap. Yeah, he's got crap. Just crap. So long. You suck. All right, next door. Everyone to me, to me. Wait a minute. Who do I? Oh, the other side. There's a door, I guess. 
Tamara's in here, huh? Aha! I'm looking for Tamara, the Bloody Baron's daughter. Your brother said I'd find her here. Voitex sent you, sir. How else would I know she was here? Wait a moment. I'll fetch her straight away. Oh, she's there, huh? Cool. What the? <laughs> Hello. You're a weird one. Huh. Well met. I guess he thinks something You're weird about the cat. And who might you be? My father sent you. Yeah. To see if you're still alive and well. I'm Geralt of Rivia. I'm quite alive and extraordinarily well, Geralt of Rivia. Better than I've ever been in this rotten life. Kelly Osborne, and now look. Me, I bid you farewell. Wait. We've nothing more to talk about. It is Kelly Osborne. Your father's a vile man. You're angry and bitter. Can't blame you. Why do you help him then? Why did you take this job? Because he knows something about someone dear to me. Promised to tell me if I found you and your mother. Got it. A bit of blackmail. Just his style. <laughs> well, now you found me, you can tell him I'm alive and I'm never coming back. Voitek claims your mother had strange marks on her hands and that a monster dragged her into the woods. That true? We were riding towards the river. Suddenly, Mum cried out, bent over, almost fell off her horse. I rode up to her and saw something strange. Her hands were on fire. And then that creature leapt from the woods. I don't know what it was, but it roared so fierce, my nose bled. I saw it topple trees. I've never been so scared in my life. What the hell? That, that thing grabbed my mum and disappeared into the woods. I wanted to turn back, go after them, but the, the horses panicked. Now I don't even know if she's alive. Huh. Before I agreed to look for you, your father told me his version of events. Tell me yours. Mine? It's dull as life amidst the swamps. My earliest memories are of a drunken father lying under the stairs, caked in mud and clutching a bottle. <laughs> Next dozen years, pretty much the same. Father would drink, disappear for days, then come home in a rage and send furniture flying. Thank the gods for war. I was glad every time they sent him off. And the quarrels. I remember him screaming at mum, the thuds as he beat her, then her sobbing. It's fucked up. I'd hide under my bed and long for silence. That's the long and short of it. Multiply by 19 and there you have my life. Finally, we'd had enough, mum and me. He crossed the line and we fled. All right, I'm gonna talk about this too. I don't mean to pry, but I know your mother had a miscarriage. His doing? He shoved her. She fell. That's how it started. We were alone. No one to help. Blood everywhere. Worst night of my life. Sorry. Must have been hard for you both. It's hilarious because her dad is Ashley like Ozzy Osbourne. Raving, and it's it Kelly Osbourne. That she never wanted the child. <laughs> Must have had a fever. She was losing blood the whole time. She didn't want the child. Said she'd sooner cut open her guts than bear another child from his seed. Damn. Aha. Uh -huh. Vortex said some monster carried off your mother. That is what happened. It was enormous, twice the size of a bear, but much quicker and more agile. It grabbed Mum before we could react. Now I don't even know if she's alive. Your mother's in Crookback Bog. Seems quite happy, actually. Though I think she's not quite right in there. Yeah, head. the old woman. What? She lives. I must go there at once and get her out. Wouldn't recommend venturing into the swamp. I've made my decision. Won't let anyone talk me out of it. Oh boy. What will you do now? Find my mum. You realize that might not be that easy. Don't worry, I'm not daft enough to believe I can do it alone. I've got some new friends now. Powerful friends. They'll help me. Who are these friends? If hmm. It's not a secret. No secret. Heard of the Church of the Eternal Fire? Huh. A priest helped me contact the Redanian witch hunters. Righteous. Brave men. They'll help. Me. I don't think they could kill the crones, though. <clears throat> so you believe in the eternal fire? 
Once the heat of the fire has set your heart aflame, it gives you strength and leads you down the path of truth for the rest of your life. I hope it'll bless you with its warmth one day. Thanks. Thing is, fire's tricky. It's easy to get burned. This is a cool twist. I like this. What about your father? Who? Oh, him. Who? I don't care. I won't go back to him. That bit of my life? Forgotten it already. Well, well. <laughs> a witcher. Never thought the Baron would stoop to hiring a monster slayer. Though I hear you're good at tracking things down. Hmm. Glad you know who I am. Haven't introduced yourself, though. Graden. Witch hunter in the service of His Royal Majesty Radovid of Redania. I'm certain you've heard of us. Rings a bell. If the Bloody Baron sent you to fetch his daughter, you'd best face it. You will fail in your task. I appreciate your concern, but I don't need it. As for Tamara, she can make her own decisions. Hmm. <coughs> Noble of you. A killer for hire abandoning his bounty for the good of another. The Hunters and the Church of the Eternal Fire thank you. So the Baron hired a Witcher to find his daughter. Interesting. All right. Where are you going to take her? Tamara must rest. She's had a harrowing experience. When the warmth of the Eternal Fire has restored her strength, we shall see about finding her mother. Hope you know what you're getting into. I've never been more certain. The Eternal Fire is the best thing that could happen to me. In that case, good luck. Thank you for respecting my choice. Farewell. They're gonna get fucked up. The crones are gonna fuck them up. <laughs> what is with this cat? Alright, well. That part's been completed now. I hit level 11. Wow, Nibbles. Nibbles the cat? Nibbles. Really? The cat's name is Nibbles. Oh, Nibbles. Oh, hold on a second. Do it yourself. A mysterious letter. We gotta read that. Let's read the mysterious letter. There it is. All is prepared. We await only your arrival. When I told the commander of your commitment and zeal, he agreed to welcome you into our ranks at once. At first, you will be put through preliminary training, but you already know how to ride and wield a blade. Unless you've already mastered the essentials, the rest will not take much time. As soon as you don our colors, we will set you in search of your mother, and we will find her, I promise, even if we have to come every inch of Velen. Huh. Well, that's it for this part. I actually want to try to help them later. See if we can find them, you know, help the mother. Get her out of the crone's control, but I don't know if that's going to happen. Look at this asshole. Fucking take everything. Take it all! Take it fucking all! Yes! Took everything. Yes. I'm curious if any of these books have anything in them. Let's look. Doesn't look like it. I sold all my other books, so there's nothing that could will uh, give me any knowledge in the bestiary, huh? Nope. All right. Well. That's it. We've done everything in this town, I guess. I'm sure there's other stuff like stores and stuff you can go to, but for now it looks like we're done here. Which being that it's such a big town, I guarantee you we're going to come back here later. The door is locked. Probably have to help him later. Alright, where is the uh, fast travel marker? Way the fuck out here. So let's go back. Let's go back and fast travel back and talk to the Baron and see what he has to say. 
Got a bunch of new side quests too, but I want to complete this quest first with the Baron. Wow, I totally didn't want to read that. I didn't even know you could. <laughs> okay then. Da -da -ta, cha -ta -ta. Okay, back to the Baron. Here we go. 